Nanbonani boys and girls, welcome to the 28th of Untulikazi and today we're going to be doing revision on a class scene in the classroom. Okay, I wonder if you still remember some of the vocabulary for a class scene. Okay, so what I want you to do is to take out your book, your line book. And then go to the page that is blank where you can draw and there you're going to draw a classroom so there's a picture of a classroom that I'm going to show you you do not have to draw exactly like it is just make sure that you have the basic things of a classroom all right so let's look at our classroom Okay, as you can see, boys and girls, there's a board and there's some chairs. Just the basic things. You obviously don't have to make it look um, so detailed, but make sure that you just know how a class looks and then you draw what you think. Use your imagination and then um, use some color. As you can see, we have a very nice colorful picture here. And then what I want you to do afterwards, I want you to label all of the things that you remember. Okay, so as you can see, there's a board, there's a window, there's a table, I can see there, chair, um, a door, a book, pencil, pen, eraser. There's so many things that you can label, but remember you are labeling it in Isi Zulu all right so what i've done here once you are done drawing i have given you some words okay so once you have done drawing let's see the words that you can use to label some of your things in isuzu okay so here are the words i did not put the english word because i need you to remember what it is okay so if any Ipensela, Ipuku, Isikwama, Ifasitela, Isitulo, Ipodi, Umnyango, Irapa, and Itafula. Alright, so those are the words. Um, I know that some of you know way more than that and we had a lot of words actually in our vocabulary um, in our blue book but these are the things that I want you to label okay so uh, make sure that you have drawn your classroom and you have all of this stuff and then go back put a little um, arrow there and then on whatever it is like let's say you labeling a chair Put an arrow that is coming from the chair and then write isitulo okay um, and then you do that with the rest of the words All right so i want you to pause here and finish that because the next slide actually has the answers but i don't want you to look at the answers before you actually label then once you are done you can look at the answers and see if you actually labeled it correctly. Okay, so let's have a look once you are done. Okay, so as you can see, I have labeled um, all 10 um, objects. And we have umnyango door, ifasitela window, ibodi board. Itafula table, isikwama bag, ipeni pen, isitulo chair, iraba eraser, ipuku book, and ipensela pencil. Okay, I went all over the place there, but it's fine. Okay, so those are the things, and you can see I have labeled them. All right, so I hope you had fun, boys and girls. Um, have a lovely rest of your day and you will hear from me tomorrow. Salam Gatle, boys and girls.